Uh, all right, last one for you. I asked you to do some homework here. Of, of This is not an easy one, I don't think. You know, obviously, Zach Eady's back, defending National Player of the Year. He's going to put up numbers again. I don't know if his numbers are going to be quite as good. I, I really don't. I, I think they're going to be more balanced. Uh, Trey Kopp and Wren's going to score a little bit more. The two guards aren't going to wear down like they did last year. A lot of guys off the bench. I, I don't think Zach Eady's going to put up. Maybe I'm crazy. I think his production could go down a little bit. Um, yeah. Who could challenge him? If I'm saying to you, who's the one guy? Who is the one player that dethroned Zach Eady for National Player of the Year? Who is it? Who is it? I, I was. I've tried to think. I don't know. I. I it's not easy. I, I right? don't think there's a clear cut answer to this. Like I, I really don't. I. You look at the best teams, yeah. like it's Kyle Filipowski if he's healthy and just balls. But I, I think that the production, his numbers are going to go down, right? No, it's going to be spread out so thin. Um, Kansas, Who's that dude, Hunter Dickinson. I think he's going to see a lot of double teams, right? I don't have an answer for you as of today. I, I tried and I, I don't know. <laughs> that's that's a cop out. Who, who would you even throw out there? Baycott, maybe. I mean, he had a bad year last year, and he averaged 16 and 10, and he had a bad year. I, I guess. I just, you know. I, when I think of him, though, I don't think of just like a bucket getter with his back. I mean, he's an effort guy, kills the offensive glass, rebounds the hell out of the ball. Yeah. I I just, I think it'll be Edie again. I, I just don't. Even if his numbers go down slightly, I don't think there's really anybody that's there to to challenge that. I mean, could Klingon put up similar numbers? I you think Klingon's going to average 22 and 13? No, I don't. I don't. Edie's going to average that. Yeah, I, I just, again, I think Baycock could average close to that. I do. No? I would, I don't know. 19 I mean, and 12? Yeah, he could probably do that. I mean, he did, I a couple of years ago, he did 13. Didn't he do 13 rebounds two years ago? No, I mean, he, he'll he rebound. I'm talking about the scoring. Yeah, but he again, he had 16 last year. They're going to run this year, and they got Cado. They don't have – think about it. They lost Caleb Love. So, like, all those shots are going to be available now. Well, those are yeah, a lot of those, shots. All those, all those rebounds are not. <laughs> all those missed <laughs> shots aren't, so. <laughs> So I, I don't know. I, I thought long and hard about it, and I honestly could not come to one player that I was like, yeah, I think he could really challenge him. I, I just – I'm going to go Baycott just because I think, again, they're going to be so reliant on him. Where, like you said, Filipowski, I love Proctor. Like, I don't know if either of those guys – No, it, it will get spread again. thin for Duke. Right, right. You know, you look at, like, Michigan State, nobody's going to put up huge numbers, you know, um, uh, Villanova, nobody's going to put, you know, you're looking at the top teams. It's got to be somebody in the top 25. Who Who is it who's going to carry the load? Yeah. Right? I, I, don't I don't know who it is. A player, there's not a player out there that I can feel comfortable saying he will do that type of production, 22 yeah, and 13. I, I'm kind of with you on that. I mean, again, I think Baycott's going to be the closest. To the Baycott and Dickinson are probably the two guys that have the best chance. But like you but, said, I just Hunter's wonder – I think it doubled with, a lot with Hunter. I just wonder with Hunter if they're not making perimeter shots, yeah. man, he's gonna. It's gonna be getting back to what we talked about at the start of this thing. Like could, Donnie could Perfect. Tyler Kolek average like an insane number of assists? All right, like fifteen points and ten assists. Yes, that would that would challenge. Right, right. I He'd have to say. lead the country in assists, and yep. Marquette be a top five team all year. Yep, that's that. That's Other pretty that, much what you're looking at. Yeah, you know, Kolek, like. Kolek, Hunter, and I, Baycott's a decent. Yeah, he. he I mean, who else? Good, I guess. Like who else? I mean, who else are we talking about? Like that. That's the thing you look at, and you're just like, who else could even do it from some of these? You know, yeah. I, nobody I in Baylor is going to put up crazy numbers. No. Uh, yeah, I, I'm. You know, and you're going to get the national player of the year from a top at least 10 team, you know, it's not like he's going to come from a top 30 team. Uh, yeah. I, I honestly don't know who it's going to be. 